dead. I'm dead. This is. I'm. I'm dead. Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. It's your girl from Spriti, and today I'm super super excited for you guys to see this blue moon makeup look. This is like one of the most beautiful makeup look I've ever done on my channel. I cannot believe that I like this came out with such perfection. Like I know this is not perfect, but this came out so so beautifully i did not expect it to come out this beautifully like this is this was something i'm not i was not ready for i cannot believe it i just fell in love with it this makeup look is definitely one of the most favorite makeup looks that i've ever done on my channel and i love 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 it it's a blue moon makeup look and i tried to draw half moons on two of my eyes and I am as you guys know that I'm not a pro at makeup I'm not a makeup artist or anything so this was like a challenge for me and I, I just had to test my makeup skills so today we're doing it all I'm just putting my everything in this video and I'm just so happy with the way this makeup look has came out it's so pretty and so so blue moon like I love it so um, if you want to know how I get and struggle through this makeup look then go ahead and subscribe my channel and hit that notification bell so that you can be notified every time I post a new video. Also, now um, I'm wearing these blue earrings, which were like the hardest to put on. My mom helped me, and these these are so beautiful. I feel like I made a really bold move to wear such big earrings, but I'm used to it. So um, and it does look good on camera. Also, I'm wearing these bracelets. I feel like it goes perfectly with my dress and also my nails. Like, I love the vibe. The love for Blue Moon is just happening on my face. So, let's hop right into this Blue Moon makeup tutorial. So, I'm already done with the base and if you want to know how I do my base, you can check out my last video. I mentioned every single thing. I literally did my base with you guys. And I don't do my base on camera because it just makes my video longer and also it's it's boring you know it's boring but still it's really really important like your base is the most important part of your makeup but still it's it, it's really really boring to do it on camera so um, but if you still want to see it check out my last video so we're gonna hop right into the eyes and I'm super super excited and for the eyes, I'm going to take my most favorite palette ever. And like this is no surprise to you if you're not new to my channel. And I'm going to take this shade right here. This blue pastel blue kind of shade. And I'm going to take this fluffy brush. And this is like a, like this is my most favorite brush of all time. Because you can blend with this brush. This is like, it has a fluffy end to it. And this is like really dense. In at the end and really really fluffy at the top so you can blend with it you can pack the color on pack the color on I'm just not able to speak today okay so um, I am gonna take this shade right here this pastel blue and just gonna pack this all over my ear this is what it looks like that's really beautiful that's exactly the kind of color I wanted so I'm gonna pack this all over my lid it's this brush is super super soft so you get such an amazing amazing application and it's just everything like you can blend with it you can pack the color everything you ever want in a brush and i'm just going to build this color up i love this color and i actually like just uh, when my dad got this top you must have seen this top in the intro i love this top this is like one of my favorite tops and when my dad got me this top um, because i can't buy it by myself because i'm not like able to earn money by myself right now <laughs> what is happening okay so um so when my dad got me this top uh, I just saw the top and the color just reminded me of this color in my eyeshadow palette. I was like, I'm going to use this color. Whenever I'll, I'll be wearing this top, this is the color that will be on my eyes. So I was so excited when I got this top. And yeah, that's what we are doing. Now on this side, I just love this brush so much. Like I'm obsessing. Every time I use it, I'm like, that is so 
like so fluffy and like it packs on the color so good and it's super soft on the eyes nothing harsh just amazing i normally don't use this brush to pack on the color on my channel but this is an amazing brush i usually use this brush like off camera but i'm probably gonna start doing it on camera as well so I'm just blending it but um, I'm almost done with the blending but uh, I just love the way this color is looking because just look at it it's so beautiful oh my god I'm in love and we are like not even done with the eye look yet but still like it's so pretty by itself this color is so pretty like if you are <laughs> My coughing is not gone yet, so I'm sorry if I will be coughing in this week. But I love this color so much. I know a lot of people don't recommend wearing blue eyeshadows. They just, I don't know why, but they don't wear it. They're like, I don't wear blue eyeshadows. Like, are you serious? This is such a pretty color. Um, okay, so the next thing, this is like the most excited thing, and I'm like nerve excited for this. I'm nervous because this is literally like going to be me testing my makeup skills and i'm not a pro or anything on make when it comes to makeup so i'm not sure if i will succeed or if i will not succeed but i want to succeed definitely so um i will try to make a moon right at the corner of my eye and by that i mean a half moon if i'll make if I if I would make a full moon, it will just look like I have a white spot on my eye. That's not what we are going for. I'm just not ready, if I'm being honest. I don't know how I am going to do it. It's just, I'm really, really nervous. But um, I'll try to do it. Hopefully, it will work. I'm just going to take an angled brush like a, um, this one that I always take in my videos. And... I'll try to make a moon and I'll do it off camera because I know I will mess it up if I'll do it on camera. Wish me luck. Are you guys ready? I am not ready to show you guys. I can't believe I did it, but I'm going to show you. Just, just take a look. Like, how beautiful is that? I don't believe that I did this because it took me like 20 minutes to draw moons like a half moon on both of my eyelids and I'm just I'm obsessed like this is so pretty oh my god and to be honest I know I've said this like millions of times on my channel that I I am not a makeup artist and not a pro at makeup but after doing this eye look I I'm feeling like an artist like I do feel like I am an a makeup artist that's what I feel like right now like that's unbelievable it took me like it took me 20 minutes I feel like to do both the eyes like not 20 minutes each that would just kill me but um in total it was 20 minutes to do both the eyes and I think it came out pretty nice because I was not expecting this at first I was like this is just not happening this is just not going to work but it just it it worked out i don't know how but it did and i'm i'm freaking out this is so pretty and i'm sorry that i will be acting crazy on my uh, video right now like in the rest of this video because i'm obsessed this looks really pretty like i have seen these kind of makeup looks a lot in my life and i've always wanted to do this but i always felt like my makeup uh, skills are not that good like uh, it's not on that level but this is another level that's what i feel like because for you guys it must be like oh it's nothing but this is a lot like i'm really proud of myself for doing this and this is i just feel like I, i'm stepping up my makeup game i i love it when i asked my brother he was like you look really weird and you know he said some funny stuff but that's that's exactly what was expected from him and I was just really laughing a lot so he always makes fun of, my, fun of my makeup but this is really but yeah now I'm gonna do my eyeliner and mascara off camera because I don't want to do mascara on camera and mess this up okay so I'm done with eyeliner and mascara I tried to make the lines as 
thin as possible so the eye look cannot be hidden by uh, the eyeliner and I almost almost um, messed up the mascara it's literally all over here but I'm happy it's not over there on my eyeliner because it took me 20 minutes and I literally I'm not gonna forget those 20 minutes because those 20 minutes made me literally just it took so much of my like I was so pressured and I was so nervous and everything was just messed up in my head but it came out so beautiful now it's time for the blush and for the blush I want to go I feel like I want to go with something light because <coughs> I'm sorry uh, I want to go with something light that, that's what I feel like because this eye look is pretty much a lot so I want to go with this blush this light pink blush and this blush is something which you really have to build it up on camera but in person like it's pigmented enough I would say like that that is really pigmented apples of my cheeks some people actually apply it like back like not on the apples of your cheek and that is weird the blushes are made for your cheeks not for like contouring some people actually apply it like they're contouring it you don't want to kill the blush a little bit on the nose you can definitely see the blush that's so pretty it's like a baby pink bubble gum kind of blush there's so many, so many makeup looks coming on your way which are going to be more harder than this one and this took me 20 minutes. <coughs> I'm trying to go, please. Um, okay, so it took me like 20 minutes to do this one. I don't know how much time it's going to take me to do the others but they're going to be way harder than this one. Like this was nothing in front of those. So I'm not sure. But this blush now I'm just gonna for the lips I have the blue going on on the eyes I want something brown and I'm just gonna take it on dope applicator but I'm just not sure if these are as pigmented as I want them to be that is uh, okay I don't know if you can even see that but that is brown but still like yeah that that's brown Okay, hopefully it will be brown enough for me. I'm not sure but uh, uh, I don't see that. Like it's brown but I don't know. So I love the lip color. It's really really pretty. I love the lip color. It's really really pretty. I just love it. It's beautiful. It goes perfectly with the eye look. I didn't want it to be too pink or I didn't want it to be too brown. So like this is perfect. I love it. For the highlight, I am going to go with Glam Hydro Bricks Palette, of course. It's no surprise. I'm going to go with this shade, the most shiny shade, which I always care to use because it's too much. Like, whoa. But, um, you know. I like the nose, that's too much. I love this highlight. Because we want to shine like a moon, so we want a highlighter which will make us shine like a moon. I'm just not able to speak right now. But I love this highlight. It's literally making me look like a moon. I'm a moon. <laughs> There's so many transformations from, I'm going to be doing on my channel. I've said this like millions of times, but I feel like it kind of got away from my channel because I've been doing makeup looks a lot recently and not transformations. So like I want to do them a lot more, but what can you do? You you can do one thing at one time. So I'm not sure when I'll be doing them, but I'm definitely gonna be doing them because whenever I think I'm gonna be doing them, I just get so excited about it. That whenever I try to film it, I'm like, I'm so excited and I just can't, can't wait. So, yeah. But I love this highlight. It's blinding. 
and that is pretty much it for this blue moon makeup look i think this look came out really really beautiful and way more beautiful than i expected it to come out because the eye look is definitely not something i thought i would be able to do it with such perfection like i know that's not perfect but still it's perfect to me because i was not hoping it to for it to look this good as well so i am really happy with the way this look has came out and i feel like a makeup artist i'm gonna say it like i don't know how many times but this is such a pretty look i love every single thing the pink cheeks the brown lips with the pink hint to it i just love it wow i'm obsessed there are gonna be so many looks which i'm gonna be doing on my channel which is going to be really really um like they're gonna test my makeup skills again but i'm i'm so so excited and nervous at the same time but just i'm nerve excited for them and yeah i loved doing this makeup look this is really really beautiful and i fell in love with it i love the way i look right now and i'm probably not gonna take this makeup off ever this is really beautiful and I'm really really proud of my makeup skills. I'm really happy that I'm like testing my makeup skills on my channel. Like that's really gonna take my makeup skills from here to here, which is a lot for me. And yeah, this is it for today's video. I love you guys so much. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I don't know what happened to my voice, but um this is it for today's video. I love you guys so much and I will see you in my next video.